This will be the last mini course on Anglo-Saxon sports and as you have understood from the previous ones, they're not necessarily Anglo-Saxon in origin, although they're widespread in the English-speaking countries as well as many others. What about tennis? If you look in a good French dictionary, say Robert, you will find that tennis, T-E-N-N-I-S, is of English origin. Not quite. Here is an excerpt from the Plan de Bal of Paris, showing Paris as it was in about 1540. And you can see that the Rue de Seine existed already. And right next to it, near Saint-Germain-des-Prés Church, was Le Pré au Clair, the student's meadow. And you see what they were playing. They were probably too poor to have a net, but they are playing the jeu de paume with little rackets. How did it get to England? Well, the jeu de paume was quite popular in Paris. Here's another representation of a match going on, this time with a net. And in the 16th century, the English king called Henry VIII he came to Paris with his courtiers and there they discovered the jeu de paume, which in English is called real tennis, R-E-A-L, but it doesn't mean real in the sense of real. Real, it means royal tennis, because the aristocracy played it. Here is Henry VIII himself, despite his weight, in about 1528, playing. Well then, how does the Robert, why does the Robert say that tennis is of English origin? When Henry VIII came home from that trip to France with his courtiers, in the English aristocracy it was thought uh, to be very cultivated to speak at least some French. And when the uh, people in Paris playing jeu de paume, when they served the ball, they threw the ball up, and as they hit it, they said, tenez. Well, when the English got home, they started doing that, but they said, no, tenez is T-E-N-E-Z, Z in American, Z in English, T-E-N-E-Z. It's not tenez, it's tenez, and that's where the word tennis comes from. To conclude, I'd like to again thank our hosts here at the Standard Athletic Club, in Meudon, founded here by some British people in 1890. I'd also like to thank the weather for having been very nice while we were filming these courses. Thank you for your sporting attention. <laughs>